Hi there, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing okay. I'm filming downstairs because my bedroom where I normally film my videos is a complete and utter mess. I've been pulling out all my old clothes. Every sort of season I sort of switch things up and I put the rest in the attic out the way. So I've got a few boxes I need to unbox and this is the easiest and quickest way I can do it. So I'm filming on my phone and this unboxing and the next one is gonna be back to front. But please don't let that put you off. As soon as my bedroom's done, hopefully tomorrow, I'll be back to normal filming with my big camera, proper microphone, proper lighting, and you won't be reading boxes back to front. <laughs> But this is going to be just a quick video to let you know that Cult Beauty has released the Buyer's Edit. It was released a couple of days ago. It contains eight products. It has a value of £120 and can be bought for £35 and it's still available on their website. As always, you'll find a link down below in my description as well as links to all my other discount codes and offers for other websites. And I currently have an Elemis giveaway running on Instagram, so you'll find a link down there. So yeah, so let's open this up and show you what's inside. I did film this the other day. I tried to film it back to front, but I was like, <laughs> I was up this close. <laughs> when I show you the items, they're going to be in a bit of a mess because I've already filmed it, swatched it, you know. So there you go. <laughs> it's a nice box. I do really like it, by the way. We have got Drunk Elephant. This is F Balm Electrolyte Water Facial Mask Hydrant. It contains vitamin F microbeads, sodium PCA. It has a pH value of 5.7 and there's 15 mils. Plus, it contains a glycolic serum. TLC from Boss, I think it is, a sample. It's got a night serum there and it is three mils. I love that Drunk Elephant do that. They do it quite often. Plus you can usually mix the little samples in with the products as well. And here's the overnight mask. The cooling quenching overnight mask plumps and restores with an electrolyte cocktail while strengthening the skin's acid mantle. With a blend of barrier replenishing ingredients including niacinamide, sodium PCA, plant squalene, five forms of ceramides, omega fatty acids and powerful antioxidants, F-Balm effectively rehydrates hungover, overly parched skin, making it soft and supple. Yeah, I love the sound of that. I haven't tried it before. I've tried a few Drunk Elephant products. But there's a lot I haven't tried, so excited to give that a go. Next up we've got Elemis. This is Superfood Glow Priming Moisturiser and there's 60 mils there. Suitable for all skin types. This is a really nice moisturiser, but I love Elemis. I absolutely adore Elemis, but not this one. It's a little bit too glowy for me, unfortunately. I don't tend to use really glowy primers all over my face. I tend to apply them in certain areas on my face, mainly around the outer corners. I don't want any glowiness going on in the middle. I've got very oily skin at the moment. Plus, besides that, ah, oh, see? There, you can't see much. A mobile phone, even though this is 15, what is it, 15 Pro Max, not as good as my Panasonic big camera. Not as clear. See a bit of a glow there, a bit of a shine. I don't want to have anything accentuated in the middle of my face. I've got large pores, fine lines, texture. Yeah, not doing very well at the minute. I've got quite a lot of spots as well on my chin. Can you see? Can you see all my lumps underneath? Oh, it's not good at all. Anything that's glowy does not make my skin look great, unfortunately. It's not super glowy. It's not like sparkly, sparkly, but it's just a little bit too much for me. But it's so nice though, it is nice. But I know I can pass that on to someone who will love it. Then we've got mascara from Hourglass. This is Unlocked Instant Extension Mascara. And it's in black. Oh, would you like my nails? I had them done earlier on. New nails. I really love the colour. Really pretty. I had two nails pop off last week, so it's come at the right time. So that is the wand. The wand looks really nice. I've only ever tried one Hourglass Mascara and that was in, I think it was a Sephora Beauty Box um, subscription box that I chose myself and I loved it. It's so nice. It's such a nice mascara. It's got a bit of a fuller wand though compared to this one. But um, we'll see how it goes. Next, we've got something for your hair. This is by Away. We've got a detox shampoo for all hair types and there's 30 mils there. And we've got a leave-in conditioner. 
and there's 25 mils here. I've used a few products from Away, different types of shampoos and conditioners. I do really like it. My hair is very thin and very fine and some leave-in products can weigh it down. A little squirt of this on my hair and it's fine, it's okay. So there's those two. But then we've got Sai or Say, S-A-I-E. And this is a dew blush in shade Peachy. There. This is a beautiful colour. I have had one of these in a beauty box or an advent calendar, I can't remember now. And it's more pinky colour. This is, as it shows, peach. And it blends out beautifully, obviously. I'm blending it on top of the Elemis Glow Primer now. It's a nice, subtle, peachy look, isn't it? Yeah, I really like that. Really love that shade. So there's that. Then we've got Charlotte Tilbury Sample. It's only a little teeny tiny. This is an Airbrush Flawless Lip Blur, a Matte Meets Moisture Liquid Lip in shade Pillow Talk Blur. And it is super small, super small. But again, I really like this. Let's put some on the corner there. A gorgeous Pillow Talk shade, but it's so nice. It's a really nice moussey formula. Yeah, I like that. And they go together, look. So that's lovely. <laughs> Small, but lovely. And the last item in the box is by Sunday Riley. It's CEO Glow. It's a vitamin C and turmeric, and this is a face oil. And there's 10 mils there. Isn't that bottle cute? Really, really nice. Put a little bit on my hand there, so I don't have to put it on top of my makeup hand. This is a really, really nice oil. I have a full size version of this and I tend to use oils. I've mentioned this many times, I think, over the last couple of weeks or so, but I tend to use oils more so in the winter months because I have combination skin, really oily in the middle at the moment, but I do tend to be quite dry around the outer corners. Not so much now, but I know coming into like December, January, February time, that's when I have it. And especially on my neck as well and my chest. So I end up putting a few drops of this into my moisturizer. So yeah, so there we go. So we got a face oil by Sunday Riley. So those are all the products inside the cult beauty buyers edit i'll just go through it all giving you a bit of a recap we've got an element superfood glow prime and moisturizer we've got a drunk elephant electrolyte water facial sleeping mask we've got a cinder riley ce glow facial oil we've got charlotte tilbury ear blush lip blue it's a matte liquid lipstick we've got a shampoo and a leave-in conditioner from away we've got a mascara from hourglass and lastly we we've got a dewy blush in shade peachy from say or sigh <laughs> has a value of £120 and is on sale for £35. Yeah, as always, I love cult beauty boxes. I do really like them. And they're coming out with them monthly now, which is really good. There might be a waiting list for some other boxes coming up. I think, I'm sure. If there is a waiting list, I would have posted it up by now. Because <laughs> as soon as I spot them, I share everywhere. Instagram, Facebook, on YouTube, if you're not already aware, on the community area, when I've got a load of offers, freebies, new releases that I want to share, I share them on Instagram and Facebook. But instead of bombarding YouTube one after the other after the other, because sometimes I've got like, like 10, 15 different offers. So that can annoy people. <laughs> so what I tend to do is when I've got a lot to share with you, then I create a daily deals post and I'll put the date up and then I'll add all the offers during that day so you can get to find out about new releases and things like that that way as well. I'd love to hear your thoughts. What do you think of this box? Please comment down below and thanks for watching and I promise my videos will be back to normal with a normal camera and setting again soon. Take care. <laughs> Bye.